Take two. Because um, the first take accidentally messed up. Hey, guess what, guys? There's a new streaming service out there. And this new streaming service is paying me millions of dollars to advertise for them. It's Disney Plus. Ain't eh, wrong. Just kidding. They're not paying me anything. There are too many streaming services already. There's like Netflix. Uh, there's a uh, YouTube Premium. There's uh, Disney Direct, Disney Plus now. There's DC Direct now. There's Hulu. There's so many different freaking streaming services. Okay. There's like and individual television stations have their own like little apps or whatever where you can stream. Now, some are free, which is cool. Free is always good. Yeah, free. But they're not really free because they have commercials. We should be outlawed. Commercials need to be outlawed because if I'm going to buy something, I won't buy it. I don't need to be advertised to be forced into thinking, hey, I need to buy this. No. I should buy a product based on the product's merit. It's value. What it does. Not... Because it looks cool, or someone told me to buy it on the online, or on the television, or the advertisement, or whatever. Anyways, there's too many streaming services. Why can't they all just unite, join together, have everything on one app, one, and um, split the money instead of having 50 different streaming services? They all want like 20 or more dollars a month, probably, or whatever. And there's like a hundred of them out there. So who has the money to buy all of them? Nobody. Nobody. Except rich people. Which probably already getting them free because they're part of United and part of the uh, company that has the streaming services or whatever. Anyway, another problem with streaming services is they're going to... Streaming services are going to eliminate the movie theaters. They're going to eliminate the television stations. And they're also going to eliminate the uh, ma a lot of manufacturing jobs because they're going to eliminate DVD sales. They're going to eliminate DVDs altogether. They're going to... They're going to, they're going to eliminate... Te and they're going to eliminate television. They're going to eliminate DVDs. They're going to eliminate... And they're going to eliminate... Uh, independent film films film artists and whatnot and they're going to narrate their political agendas in their television series uh, that are exclusive to their streaming services they're going to narrate their agendas in their shows that are only on their streaming services they're going to eliminate the movie theaters because why would you want to go to the movie theater and pay ten dollars or more a ticket when you can pay twenty dollars a month to get everything that the people make they're going to eliminate the manufacturing and printing and buying and selling of actual dvds because why would someone buy a DVD when they can watch it free on the streaming service? Free or whatever. I had to pause because somebody likes to interrupt. Shh. We need to stop interrupting. Shh. Anyway, streaming services are going to eliminate a lot of stuff. Which is going to eliminate a lot of jobs. I mean... People who manufacture, create, whatever, DVD cases are going to lose their jobs. People who print the pamphlets that go into DVDs and own the DVD cases are going to lose their jobs. A whole bunch of stuff is going to be lost of jobs because everything's going to be online. Everything's going to be online. There's going to be no tangible, physical merchandise and items of these videos 
it's all going to be online which means it can be easily easily eliminated and destroyed and lost and disappeared because if it doesn't fit the narrative or the people or they don't own the copyright or whatever to it it's just going to disappear float away it'll be edited so that anything they don't like won't be in it and all this other various different things it'll be destroyed anything they don't agree with and don't like people who they don't like who want to create shows and content that are not fitting of their political agendas will be fired Seriously, streaming services are going to ruin everything. And there's too many of them. Way too many. <clears throat> and whatever, I mean, seriously, you're going to eliminate hundreds of millions of jobs. In manufacturing, and printing, and stocking, and etc., etc. And then you're going to come out with toys. This is the worst part. The fact that they're going to come out with toys based off of these shows that are only available online on the streaming service or whatever. So then us people who are like um, didn't watch the streaming service, we're going to be like, I don't even know who this character is. I don't know nothing about it. I can't afford the streaming service, so why would I buy this action figure? Exactly. We wouldn't. We can't afford to buy them. And then, seriously, it's just going to have more people being watching shows on their phones and their tablets and their laptops and whatnot and being less social interactive with actual people which is going to divide us even further which is the agenda of the new world order so streaming services are bad they they're going to cost they're going to cost lives jobs and divide us even further from social interaction they're not going to help they're going to hinder society technology is not good when it's in the wrong hands and these streaming services are the wrong hands and we don't need a million and one streaming service We don't need every corporation having their own. We don't need division. We need united. We don't need political ideologies and whatnot in our shows. We don't need them forcing their way on their customers. We don't need all these streaming services. I don't see what the big hype with all the streaming services are. We should boycott them and tell them we want it back to the old ways. We want printed merchandise. That's what streaming services are going to eliminate too. They're going to eliminate print. You won't. There won't be comics anymore if everybody's getting digital. There won't be books anymore if everybody's listening to them online or reading them online. There won't be. And you know what happens if. If we get rid of print, 
we get rid of the First Amendment. We get rid of free speech because we get rid of print. We get rid of free speech because we get rid of print. Whoever controls the corporations that own the stories will get to decide what stories you get to read or listen to. They'll be in charge. And what you read, listen to, and watch will control your mind. And the people who control your mind will control you. And you'll be indoctrinating these people from young. Eliminates the freedom of choice. It eliminates jobs. It eliminates... It sh it'll make you... It'll indoctrinate people into their way of thinking instead of your way of thinking. And it'll divide us further. It will just divide us further. And it will keep us from being social because people will be online watching, reading, listening to these streaming services. So say no to stream. And say yes to social. And say yes to freedom of thought, expression, speech, and all those good things, which you won't be getting with the streams. I know it's a new system, but free speech should be free. Should literally be free. Social media should be social. Should be literally social. You shouldn't be meeting friends all across the world and never meeting them in person. Technology is ruining society. And these stream services are bad. Because they're eliminating hundreds of millions of jobs. They're destroying paper. They're destroying plastics. They're destroying manufacturing. They're destroying a whole bunch of industries. They're going to destroy the art industry. They're going to destroy the writing industry. They're going to destroy the film industry. Because these stream services are going to own and operate their own writers, artists, film, film photographers, photographers, filmers, etc. And anybody who doesn't agree with the bosses, the owners, the leaders, the heads, politics, and other belief systems will be fired and will not be allowed to work there and and their their ideas their writings their 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 art their art styles their writings their speech Whatever it will be censored because it will not be allowed in their company. And that is what is wrong with the streaming services. The idea that a few super powerful rich elites will be able to control everyone. Remember, God is good all the time. All the time God is good. Keep on gaming. Keep on collecting. Jesus loves you. Jesus is God. Like, comment, subscribe, and share, and that's what I think about streams. So, stream off. Stay on. Get woke, go broke. Think for yourself. Be your own person. Question authority.